uh, hey guys, uh, I'm gonna try and make this one quick because I don't really know what to say, I haven't really planned anything and uh, I don't have a lot of time and I don't really see the point in wasting your guys' time when I have probably done enough of that already. Um, especially with, I know what I'm like for update videos, those things be long AF, historically speaking. Um, you probably wonder what was going on, there's no webcam right now, it is black, and that's because I don't want to get like emotional on camera, really. Um, I don't think I will, but I also don't really know how to like act right now, so I'm kind of just going to talk, and then I feel like I don't have to worry about being on camera. I can just speak from the heart <laughs> and just let the words be the words instead of having to worry about like the extra you know pageantry of being in front of a camera and look it's, it's easy for a boy like me who looks so damn good all the time but um nah for real i don't really know what to do i don't really know what to do with this video so i was like fuck it i'm just gonna have a black screen i'm just gonna talk and i'm just gonna be honest um i think this has been coming for a little while now uh, you may have heard me I'd say little things in videos, um, if you know me outside of YouTube, you have, we've probably had conversations about it, particularly like Josh and Jacob, um, who, who do you, uh, videos as well, and are good friends of mine, I've done plenty of collaborative content um, over, over however long, um, in various different formats, but I think um, it's, it's finally time to, uh, I don't know how to even phrase it, call it a day, so to speak. With all this YouTube stuff, I think I might, um, I think I might be be wrapping things up, and it's not probably not too much of a shock. I haven't uploaded to Yeti Hype for over a year. I haven't uploaded to Yeti Ness, and that was like the main thing, and it was going really well. And then I just did shit, and I haven't uploaded to that for five months. And even Yeti Plays, that was like the one thing I was holding on to because it was like this core thing with with like it was I was uploading so often to it. It was like such an integral part of my life and like day-to-day -day life as YouTube has been for forever but even with the Yeti plays it was like daily and I was doing stuff with my friends and like my friends would jump, like, watch my videos and then I'd watch my friends videos but it's just I think it's, it's been coming for a little while I had a sort of talks not too long ago with with uh, Josh and Jacob about like lack of motivation and stuff um, and it was not too long after Inside came out actually by Bo Burnham we were talking about like the, the feeling of wanting to accomplish something creatively but then knowing that we would never be able to um, accomplish something to the standard of that or, or something that would make as much of a cultural impact or in, individual impact in someone's life or just like I don't know maybe it's holding ourselves to too high of a standard because we don't have crazy time you know to full time to dedicate to our craft we don't have the budget not that there was a massive budget for inside but you know what I mean like we don't we can't lock ourselves in a room and focus on this project with as much budget as we need to get it done you know what I mean like it's, it's different but and, and there, there was definitely more grandiose ideas I had within my head that I was never quite able to reach the heights of just because of time constraints and you know resource constraints I guess um, but at that point I kind of had this thought that I was never really going to be able to reach where I wanted to reach and have kind of just felt burnout ever since because um, it's one thing to get burnout but then like what do you do when you don't know how to fix that burnout you know and I've changed my content up so many times over the years you can scroll through Yeti Hype and see phases of those like let's plays or now he's doing Elder Scrolls lore videos or now he's doing edited content now he's doing this now he's doing that now he's made a new channel now he's doing reactions all of a sudden now he's doing let's plays on another channel now he's doing sparkle quizzes like I I've tried to reinvent the whole lot and I always end up burnt out and it kind of reaches a point where it's like I'm trying to just fight the inevitable and, and just just chase something and I don't even know what um, but there's other stuff in my life I, like I just don't have there's other stuff in my life in two capacities I, like I just struggle to keep to maintain like work and like social life and um, you know I've, I've, I've got uh, everything going on with my girlfriend and I've got uh, new friends now because I've got my girlfriend's friend, friend group who are all great and I love hanging out with them and then I've got you know my own um, social stuff with like my friends and then I've got my friends in America and it's like a lot to keep up with with work as well because work be or adult life you have no time to do anything ever so it just I haven't really and part of me was like okay I'm settling into a new job it's gonna take a bit then I'll find the time then I'll get my routines going and then I'll I'll get back into uploading it's been like six months and I have no time at all. I have less time than I don't have 
physically do not have time to sit down and do a single video and when I do have the tiniest little bit of shred of time I can't be fucked to press the power button on my PC and wait seven years for it to load and muster up the energy after a day of work to do a video I just don't think I have that in me and then I'm making videos where I put the video out and I'm like that was shit like I wasn't even entertaining I spent 20 minutes sat here saying I don't know what to talk about and I can only make the I'm not a youtuber anymore I'm just a guy lol joke so many times and I don't want to keep putting out videos that are shit because my friends watch these and I'm wasting their time. If I'm putting them on the bigger channels, yet you know, they're going to get views and it's going to reflect on me and that's not the sort of creative output that I want to have. I want to put out a better product and I just don't think I have the capacity to produce that right now. So, and on that point, as I said, I feel like I've just been delaying the inevitable and I think it's time to maybe just move on and stop having it way over, you know, hover over me like it has done for the past year or so and more strongly for the past three, four, five months. It's been a great ride and um, I'm really appreciative of everyone who's joined me on it I'm, and I will be eternally grateful of YouTube because I met my good friends Will and Josh via YouTube and um, by proxy, by extension of that, then met um, Jacob and then met um, a bunch of other non-YouTubing friends um, via Josh and, you know, I'm now going over to America in June to meet those people in person and hang out with them and spend time with them because they're really important to me and it's worth going to the other side of the planet to see them. And that was because of YouTube, which is crazy. I had so much fun with it over the years. It's been such like a key part of my life. I'm really grateful I've been able to go on this journey. Um, and I'm really grateful for my friends, all of whom will be linked in the description because if I'm not going to upload anymore, you're going to need someone to watch, so watch them. Um, although I'm putting this on Yeti Plays because I'm like, man, no one's going to watch it because on Yeti Hype, it's been over a year. If I disappear for five months on Yetiness and suddenly upload this, people are going to be like, it's going to be a big fuss, a big deal. I don't really want it to be a big deal. I kind of just wanted to put something up, so I feel like I've acknowledged it instead of just disappearing without saying anything, as I've done before, to be fair, and then end up coming back. No coming back now. I've said it. It's out there. And then I guess if on Yetiness anyone ever asks what happened to me, I can just sort of link them to this and be like, yeah, this, and then rather, so it's not like a big deal, but then it's something to link back to, you know what I mean? Hey guys, watch him. I appreciate you all, and um, sorry if this game is a bit of a shock, but I will see you guys, I guess, not next time. Okay. Goodbye.